I'm Jordan Chu, reporting to you live with Leadership News. Today we're talking about Kyle Dubas, the now Assistant General Manager of the Toronto Maple Leafs. We're going to go talk to some of his former professors to find out more about Kyle. Kyle came to class. He was there every class. He was on time. He did his work and he paid attention. And that is what you need to succeed in my classes. And I'm not saying that's all you need to succeed in life, but if you can't do that, you might not get too far. So Kyle passed that test and is now a huge success. Very uh, organized. I think time management was really important. He did extremely well in his classes overall. And, um, and I, th I think the sacrifices he made while he was um, uh, scouting during, you know, in between classes and, uh, you know, like I think that speaks to a lot of his time management skills and uh, his ability to prioritize what was important uh, for, you know, combining his degree with practical experience and, and keeping involved in, in the work of scouting. Um, Kyle, I think, was, was great in the visibility that we received as a result of Kyle's success um, is really, I think, uh, the catalyst is the fact that he's so young making the, the assistant general manager position. And because he was so young, uh, he ends up, you know, in the media being covered uh, and, and they always talk about where he did his degree because he's, you know, just fresh out of school. Um, and, and doing extremely well in professional sport. And so that, I think, played a key role in, in the reputation of our program and, and putting us on the map and keeping us on the map in a very positive way. Um, okay, I do, I, I recall Kyle very well. He, uh, a serious student, and pretty clear, certainly looking back, 2020 vision, but looking back, he, he knew what he wanted and where he was going. Not specifically, because I remember he was intent on going to law school, actually, uh, but got a better job. Uh, but he was a very serious student, hard worker, uh, detailed. But I also remember his demeanor. He was quiet, but, um, but had a presence about him. Um, and that was in his tone, in his posture, in his uh, deportment, all of that sort of one, one package.